Okay, um, hi Year 6, welcome to Thursday, June the 4th, and today we're going to be looking at a type of poem called a haiku, a Japanese poem, which you might be familiar with, and we're going to be thinking about the structure of them, and we're also going to be thinking about some ideas of topics that we could write about, so we're going to be creating our own lockdown haikus tomorrow. And this is also work which is taking place for the children in Year 6 who are back at Ashton Gate. And we would really like to share our poems all together at the end of the week. So as a way of making us all feel a bit more connected and sharing what we've all been, all been up to. OK, so hope you enjoy. You might want to pause the next few slides to give you time to read the haikus again when I have finished. The first haiku is called Showing Our Thanks. We clap together with our neighbours and our friends, thanking those who help. Pause the slides and think, what is this about? What do you notice about the structure? And how does it make you feel? Haiku number two is called Keeping in Touch. Communicating in high-tech ways with loved ones so our world can heal. Pause the slides again. And think, what is this haiku about? What do you notice about the structure? What is the same or different from the one you read before? Just as before, what is this haiku about? What do you notice about the structure? Are they all the same? And how does it make you feel? A haiku is a traditional form of Japanese poetry. Haikus do not require a rhyming pattern, but they do require a particular pattern of syllables. We can do them together if that helps. Pen. Candle. Butterfly. Can you work out now how many syllables each one has? Now have another look at the haikus. Can you recognise a common syllable pattern within them? It might help to pause the slides and clap the syllables. You can jot down how many are in each line. What do you notice about the syllable patterns in this haiku? Is it the same as the previous one? Hopefully you discovered that haikus always have three lines of poetry with the following numbers of syllables. Five in line one, seven in line two and five in line three. You might want to go back and check the haikus that we've already looked at if in case you didn't notice it. We would like you to think of some ideas which you could write a haiku about. We would like it to be linked to your experiences and feelings over the last 10 weeks in lockdown. Here are some ideas which you might consider composing a haiku about. We are sure there are many more you can think of. You might want to write about the things you've done to keep yourself busy during lockdown. You may want to write about how you've kept in touch with family and friends. You might want to talk about the way that the city and your environment has changed and the things you've noticed that have been different when you've been in lockdown. We would like you to plan two haikus. They could be about your changing feelings from the beginning of lockdown to now, things you have enjoyed and things you have missed or how you've kept in touch with family and friends. It is your choice. Record your ideas in a small brainstorm. You can see that I've begun with my two different ideas in different colours. Remember, you are writing in note form. Please keep hold of your planning for tomorrow's lesson. Remember, you can come back to it during the day and add ideas to it if you think of anything.